Hello friends, good morning. Today I am going to cover some of the useful modules from our own Odoo Community Association library which are available for free uh, and adding uh, good functionality to ease your life in sales process. So we are going to discuss how you can split delivery by date, how you can set invoice policy on sales order, how you can add a product set or combo very easily and how you can add you know multiple product in one go like you know a product catalog in version 70 so yes i am going to cover everything in version 16 uh, instance on enterprise where i would like to show you first uh, that if for any sales order or customer you want to have to change invoicing policy based on in you know, order quantities or delivered quantities from what is available in default how you can get it so your invoicing standard policy is what is delivered but inside your sales order in quotation for certain customer you want to change this policy to order quantities then you can do it easily from here uh, not from you know changing any master configuration but on order only so that's available over here the second feature is uh, you know how you can add multiple products in one go so here after you know selecting multiple products and you can set quantities very easily by you know changing over here and add those products very easily in product a similar feature like version 17 catalog the next feature is how you can create product set so you can create a bundle a combo of your products and then you can easily add those items you know in your quotation very easily by selecting your combo and set. so this is how uh, you will be able to uh, you know create your quotation very easily with these features right and the next good feature is how you can split your delivery based on your customer need like for this particular item the customer is asking to deliver on 31st july this item customer is asking to deliver on 15th august then the rest of the items on you know 15th august then this item you know again product one he would require somewhere in september first so when you define a specific delivery date over here and without date how Odo will react or this module will react when you confirm this order it will automatically split your delivery based on delivery date and where delivery dates are not mentioned it will pick up the default lead time so that is today second one is in seven days third one is in 22 days and rest in 39 days so according to our will 31st july i want to set you know mrp1 i want to deliver it the next stock product one and product two five unit at 50 units on 15th of august and then the rest product one again one unit on 1st september so these are the features you can very easily get available for free from our own oca library i will send the link in my video tutorial so you can download and use some of the modules are also available in version 17 you can very easily find it out from here okay so yeah that these modules are make going to make your sales process easy and I'm going to cover more series on sales uh, extension from OCA in coming days. Thank you very much.